What's going on, guys? Legend in two games. Real fans, real talk. The quarantine tour continues. Hope you guys are staying safe, staying indoors, man. Uh, with that being said, though, the sports talk never stops, man. So we got to get into it. Uh, as a Knicks fan, uh, I will say nothing made me happier than knowing the season had ended early. All right. Uh, not as an NBA fan, because I, I was definitely interested to see how these playoffs were going to play out. But as a Knicks fan, it put us out of our misery about 16 games early. And I was okay with that, all right? It was a bad season. I know it. Everyone knows it. All right, but now there's news leaking out that Leon Rose, who's head of basketball operations and president now, uh, is interested in bringing in Elton Brand to be the general manager of the team. And I'm going to let you know right now, I don't like it, and I want no parts of it. Uh, Elton Brand, to me, hasn't proven that he is a capable general manager yet. He hasn't done anything in Philly, uh, his short time there, aside from kind of waste assets and waste money. He wasn't part of the original regime that was um, called the process or, you know, trust the process. And so now you're telling me you want to bring in a guy who wasted away assets, wasted away money, and looks like he's wasting away Ben Simmons and Joel Embiid uh, with his decision making. Uh, I'm not thrilled about it at all. And for those of you guys that don't know um, some of the moves that he's made, again, he made a trade for Tobias Harris where they gave up a lot of assets and first round picks only to overpay Tobias Harris afterwards. They made a trade for Jimmy Butler, again, wasting assets and young players only to let Jimmy Butler leave after half a season. Uh, he overpaid for Al Horford. Um, I'm not thrilled with anything he's really doing there. He also gave up on Markel Fultz, I thought a little quick for nothing, really, pennies on a dollar. And so now you're telling me, as a Knicks fan, we're in a situation where we need to trust the process and rebuild through the draft and make smart decisions in free agency. And we wanna bring on a guy who hasn't been able to make any of those smart decisions over in Philly. I'm not with it. I think there are much better candidates out there. Um, I know we're not gonna get Ujiri from Toronto. I understand that Sam Presti from Oklahoma City is under contract, so he may not be a viable option. But if we're gonna do it, we gotta do it right. And we got to bring guys in who are going to be patient and understand how to build the team and develop and cultivate the young talent we currently have. Uh, there are some guys on this team that I like a lot. R.J. Barrett, Mitchell Robinson, uh, Kevin Knox still needs a lot of work. But again, still very young, very raw. So there are guys on this team and we could do some things and, and start moving it in the right direction. But you got to bring in someone who's better suited for the job than Alan Brand, man. Just my thoughts. But you guys let me know what you think. Like it. Comment. Uh, let me know if you have a better name that should be in place. Throw it out there, man. All right. With that being said, Legend of Two Games, Real Fans, Real Talk. We'll be on the air real soon. Uh, but till then, guys, stay safe, stay indoors. Smush Parker here, formerly up to Los Angeles Lakers. And you are now tuned in to Real Fans, Real Talk. Real fans, real talk, we as real as you thought Real 